Morning all, it's a cold and frosty morning here in southern Hampshire and um, this is the announcement of the 2018 Scion Wood send out. As you know I was ill last year and I, well, I won't go into it but I didn't send out only a, only a very small number of Scions last year. Um, but I will be sending out something like this year. In fact I've taken a week's annual leave uh, in the second week of March. So that's when it will be packed and I'll be cutting the Scion Wood over the next week. So. If you look down, scroll on, show more, I'll show you what's available. Um, some of it there's lots of, some of it there's very little of, so request what you want and um, I'll see what's available. Um, as ever, there's a limit to how much I can send out, so when I get to about maybe 80 or 100 orders, or requests I should say, I'll stop. Um, the signwood is free. Um, I wouldn't charge you for the wood if you came to my orchard I'd just give you some. Postage and packing I will bear the cost of because I can afford to and because this means something to me. Um, so you don't owe me any money at all but uh, I am encouraging and suggesting a donation to Tree Aid uh, which is a wonderful charity working in Africa uh, to help uh, poor Africans living at the southern edge of the Sahara Desert to improve their lives and their environment by planting and caring for and monetizing uh, trees. It's a wonderful charity, it's not a religious charity. Uh, do look it up and if you would like to make a donation then please do. But is it, your sign what is not conditional on that, it is a free gift from me. But we, all think we can all feel better if we've raised some money for this noble and worthy charity. Um, so, uh, please don't make large orders, uh, bear in mind I'm giving my time, I can afford two or three hundred pounds easily um, for the postage and packing, but uh, my time is a bit more precious than that, so do make me smile by being generous um, to uh, Tree Aid. And, and that's it, as ever, I cannot send wood across the Atlantic. Uh, for biosecurity and legal reasons, um, so it's not worth asking. But I do send wood to um, mainland Europe, and in fact I think I've sent wood uh, as far north as Finland, as far south as Turkey and Portugal, and pretty much most other European countries in between. Uh, and I've got a special feeling for um, former communist um, uh, Eastern Europe countries. Uh, so please don't ask for large orders. I'm uh, suggesting that people limit that, that to four varieties. Uh, it gets much more than that. It just is extremely burdensome for me. Uh, but if you've got a special project on, like for example, uh, you know, you're starting a community orchard or um, something like that, then um, ask me nicely and I'll see what I can send. Okay, so please get the orders in as quick as you can so that I can know how much to cut, because I've got to cut the wood by the end of February. Um, and um, so as soon as I know, I, I will put a stop when I, I've got as, about as much as I feel I can deal with. Um, so do the following. Send me an email on molecatcher2015 at gmail.com. I'll say that once more. Molecatcher2015 at gmail.com um, with uh, what, the, the wood that you want. Write it very plainly. Write it very in very plainly. And your address. Your full postal address because um, that will be, uh, I, will pr I will copy that, I will copy and paste that and print it out so what you write will be what I send. Uh, so your postal address, what wood that you'd like and um, send it to me on molecatcher2015 at gmail.com. I will send you an acknowledgement and um, I'll post some catch up um, details here later. So um, I hope that will be successful. Please don't order it unless you will definitely graft it and make use of it. But if you do want to definitely graft it and make use of it, then when we first set this project up 25 years ago, as discussed in my book, Tales from an English Orchard, available from Kindle um, uh, for uh, just five dollars, five US dollars or whatever your local currency is, please do consider downloading a copy that tells the whole story uh, from imaginings and dreamings right up to the present day or at least to October last year when I printed it, I published it. Um, so send me that as quick as you can and um, any queries put them down below. But if you have sent a request for wood by any other means, please send it again to molecatcher2015 at gmail.com. Okay, and uh, right, start the weekend. <laughs>